Craig, I've asked Paige a lot about you. You had a romance with Paige? Whoa, I figured whoa, something whoa, whoa. was going on. I actually just asked about her long distance relationship. Oh, because you don't believe in long distance? Listen, I have my doubts about long distance is what I'm saying. We honestly love our space, but I know she definitely likes her space and watching her shows. And then we get like... <laughs> I do love watching my Craig's not joking. He's being like, he's like, he's like being dead ass serious. Then, so like, like, then we have like four or five days together, and I feel like that time together is almost more genuine than time that I've spent with people in the past. Where do you spend more time, Charleston or New York? Right now, she hasn't been back to Charleston in like two months because she's busy in the city, so I come up. I don't know next chapter because it's been a year now. I don't know what the next chapter looks like, but I start to get lonelier quicker now. I don't think Craig really understands what he's asking me. He just wants me around more, but I don't want to go down to South Carolina more. So do you guys meet anyone fun? Like Mammy, but I don't even remember. How do you feel? Have you talked to Danielle after dinner last night? No, I haven't, and I don't even know if today is the day to do that. Did you talk to him about this? N no. Okay. The message for me was that like she just like upset about the state of your friendship. I'm happy to take responsibility for like half. Yeah. But yeah. like the other half, it's like okay, why don't you make a trip into the city and we can hang out? Yeah. Now that Danielle's finally speaking up about it, it'll validate everything we've ever said about Lindsay. <laughs> it's no <laughs> secret that. Lindsay is literally the common denominator in everyone's fights. And then there's always and then like, acts like, what did I do? I'm, I'm such a good friend. I never questioned you when you moved in with your boyfriend after knowing him for two months. I didn't question her when she quit her corporate job to go start her fashion app. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna support you no matter what. Right. Like, okay. why are you keep questioning me? Like, do you not think that I'm a capable, smart adult? And she also said yesterday, like, if you're not hard on your best friend, then you're not a best friend. But like, to me, like, what she but was saying wasn't really hard on it. Yeah. Hard. It wasn't like tough love almost. Like, it felt a little bit accusatory. If Lindsay's drinking and partying less because she's trying to support her partner who is battling this extraordinary demon, who the f are we to have an opinion about that? Lindsay and Danielle need to find a way to service their friendship in other areas. And if your friendship needs alcohol and partying to survive, that says something else about your friendship, honestly.